Hello, it's Friday evening and my other vlog just literally went up this morning but I have had a couple of parcels today. I should have got the stuff from print work I think, the samples, but I have got a couple of things to show you. Etsy, very kind and gave me a five pound voucher. So this was 4 95 so I got this free with free delivery and I think they're supposed to be for furniture but some butterfly stencils for me to try with the art journaling. So that was from Anna Catherine Stencils. So might try that tomorrow. But these are their cards. A load of envelopes first. Oh, by the way, as well, this morning I had my second COVID jab. So, arm is feeling a little bit sore. It did the first time as well for a good 24 hours. And I, I've just been a little bit sleepy. Now, I think that the packets now from Six Print are actually compostable. So that's really good for the environment. <laughs> I'm desperate to get to these cards. It's all in the packets. Oh, do they, I, I don't think, I don't think the DL things have um, plastic packets. Oh yes, they do. Oh, this is one of my new ones in here. I'm not going to go through and check all of them because I've got 40 designs. And I, I do actually count all of the cards <laughs> from each. So I've got like 400 cards to count through and check. These ones on the top are some of the new ones, which I'll show you. I'm excited about these ones. because this is a new range. One of my favourite ones on the top. Oh, that looks nice. I'm gonna, I'm gonna fold them. Of course, they all come flat and I've got to fold them, put the envelope in and then put them in the plastic packet. There's 400 of those. But my son has been sent home from school isolating. So he can maybe help me. He didn't like that idea. <laughs> These are the sketches and that is Dunstanborough Castle, which is on the 29th of June 2019. So that shows you how long it's been that I've got round to doing these. Yeah, I, I really like these. And I've, for these ones I've kind of kept a little board around them as well. So that was Derwent Reservoir. This is Bolam Lake and I've got a Morpeth Bridge one there as well. There. And I think I might do these in sets. I can't remember how many I've ordered of these ones. But yeah, I love those. They look fabulous. Six print are always really good. And then they're just some of the contour ones. Never seen this packaging before. Oh, that's another new one. Another new one is Serenity. Ooh, really quite pleased how, with how this one has turned out because that is three of the cactus paintings just kind of put together. And I wasn't sure whether the sizes were good with each other, but I really like that. So yeah, I'm pleased with that. What I am not looking forward to though is folding and packaging all of this lot up. This is what 400 cards look like. <laughs> but I don't have to do it all at once. And I'm pleased to announce my samples have arrived. Oh, that's handy. They've put a little sticker in there so you can see what the stickers are like. 
oh, sorry, past the parcel. And it's very, very warm today, even though it's not sunny. So <laughs> I don't know if it's the, the jab that's making me feel absolutely boiling or just the temperature. I don't know if I'm blown away by them. Buddha Castle. See that looks a bit dark to me. Oh, so they all must be on the elephant. What did I order? Yeah, elephant. And uh, these are on the unicorn white. That looks better. I thought the elephant because um, watercolour paper is actually not like really white, but Oh, I prefer, the, I prefer the unicorn. I don't know if you can see that. Unicorn's on the top. Right, I'm going to have a, a proper look at those and make decision. That, that looks, that does look better. Yeah. Just cleared a space because hopefully my art desk is going to be installed in there later today, fingers crossed. Uh, yikes, it's really raining now. <laughs> so I'm going to get back in the house. Might just stay here for a little bit.
As you can see, I have my new desk, art desk, lots of lovely space at the minute <laughs> to sort out the cards and the prints that I got the other day. I haven't had a chance to look at them properly, but I've laid them all out here and I will decide, yeah, I definitely, definitely like the unicorn white but I need to decide how to sell them, whether just to sell them like that and write the price on the back. I guess I'm probably going to need to put a sticker or something on the back with my details on or whether to put them in a clear face bag. Go and get one. These are currently the clear face bags that I've got. So I would have to uh, just put them in and fold them over like that. Now, people will probably ask, why don't you get some A5 like cellophane bags like this? Mostly the reason is, is that I have got most of a box full of these clear face bags left. And because I am eco-friendly, I want to use up what I have. So even though this doesn't look quite as professional, it's still... <laughs> kind of one of those people that yes well does packaging sell uh, help sell your product probably but I think with art as long as it's protected and it looks reasonable then I think that it it's acceptable <laughs> but anyway that is that is the reason eco-friendly so I need to decide what to price these at and I think that will probably be a good weight and have some A4 ones as well but I need to decide which designs. I'm going to Keeper's Cafe tomorrow. She can probably let me know if there's any that she would like to take and then I can get them to her. So today I need to check that I've got all of the cards. I've checked the square ones, they're all present and correct. I need to check all the other ones so that's like 300 to go <laughs> and I will just show you this quickly work in progress I didn't actually show you this on the last vlog it was just in the background uh, with the green bit that is the stencil I don't like that butterfly on there I'm going to go over it in white I think but I really quite like the flowers but I want to put I want to do something else to it so kind of add layers so I think I'm going to go over the butterfly I love the colours but I just don't think that it stands out against that green so I'll see whether I get time to do that today but most importantly I love the tennis and Emma Radakanudu whatever she's called <laughs> from Britain is uh, playing in the fourth round at um Right, later on this afternoon so actually that that's fine because then that gives me time so I will be breaking early to watch that so I better get on with with doing this lot and I'll catch up with you later I've packaged some of the cards up to take to keep us tomorrow but to pop on to Facebook I love it that I can just set up the light which was in the corner and use the corner of the desk just to pop some cards to take a quick photo on my phone for Facebook just so that then the image is out there today and that's all I need I think for social media. I did realise though that I was a doofus and I haven't ordered some of the cards that I was going to. I was going to order the new cat designs and the thoughtful one that goes with the serenity one that I showed you in a previous clip and then when I was looking through the prints, the A5 prints, there was the iris on the orange background and I meant to order that one as well. So and actually after I put place the order I forgot that I hadn't done the rainbow elephant. So I've got like seven 
designs or something that really need ordering. And really, I need to do them in bulk to keep the cost down per card. So um, I might have to, <laughs> I might have to put another order of cards in. Ooh. What a nana. <laughs> I'm just editing the vlog today for tomorrow's video and I thought I would show you, I think it's finished, I'm not quite sure. <laughs> I put a poll on Instagram stories to ask whether I should put a butterfly quote on it and I didn't actually look at the final results but the last time I looked it said uh, overwhelmingly no. So I think I'll leave it without the quote but I'm not quite sure whether to add a couple of roses up here. I feel like that corner needs something so I'm not quite sure. So I am going to leave it propped up here for a little bit to let it kind of settle in with me to see if it needs anything. I've ordered some A5 prints, even though Keepers, she said that she would prefer something mounted and finished, so she wasn't going to take any, but I have ordered some for the Art Trail, uh, which starts on Saturday the 10th of July and runs till the 24th of July. There's a virtual video of the, the art tour that is up on Prada Community Group, I think. YouTube so if you go and try and find them then you can see that see my artwork up at the Emporium and the cards and the A5 prints will be available there hopefully from Saturday if I get them tomorrow because I had to do speedy delivery. I hope you enjoyed the blackbirds they are so sweet and we do have to stand on a chair to look into the nest so I, I won't be doing that again I just wanted to get a shot for the video. <laughs> But yes, second art vlog out in two weeks. I had thought about doing the art vlogs, so if you're watching and you watch the vlogs, please let me know in the comments below if you actually watch like the other content, so kind of the tutorials and the paintings, because I want to see, obviously I want to get the channel grown, though I was almost on 150 and now I'm on 146 so YouTube must have had a bit of a clear out. So I was almost there. <laughs> but um, so obviously I want to get the views, I want to get the subscribers, so I kind of have to make what you guys want to see. So yeah, let me know if you watch the other stuff as well or whether I should just continue trying to do the vlogs with quite a bit of painting in them or do maybe a painting with more of the vloggy vlogginess. But yeah, so don't forget you can buy me a virtual coffee on coffee.com. Link will be in the description below. I have yet to get my goal for the inks, so any little bits of 
bits of donations would be lovely. I, I do hate asking, but um, yeah, it's something that I have to do, isn't it? <laughs> Otherwise, no one's going to do it. Hit the like button, that really helps, and the subscribe button if you enjoy the content, and I shall see you in the next one. Bye!